in today's video hope you all doing well so in today's video I'm gonna share with you guys a simple recipe I'm going to make makoso pork feet and aside I'm going to make green vegetables we are going to harvest them right now in my garden so if you're new here watching my video don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post of notifications so you can be notified every time I upload new video on my channel I usually share videos of recipe cleaning motivation vlogs and decoration so please feel free to join the family so let's go to the garden first and then we're gonna come and start our recipe I need celery and the green pepper and the celery and I'm gonna get celery so this is the vegetables we're gonna be making today the pumpkin leaves don't be surprised I'm still having garden <laughs> so this video I shoot it before I remove all the vegetables in my garden it was around I believe september i believe so september i can't really remember but i believe i shoot this video in september and i totally forget to publish it <laughs> so don't be surprised and be like it's already snowing and uh, it's already winter how come she still have a garden <laughs> no i shoot this video i guess it's around september something like that i totally forget to publish it i just remember now so there I'm just harvesting the vegetables once I'm done I'm gonna go inside and start to cook So now I'm going to prepare everything I'm going to need and then I'm going to put the dishes away I washed last night so I can have a free space. I usually like to prepare all my stuff so I can have a quick access on anything I would like to use. I'm going to clean the meat. I'm going to use vinegar and salt just to make sure it's very well clean. So the meat I'm going to cook, I mix pork feet, makoso and pork ribs.
I just finished to clean the meat. I'm going to place it on the oven. Then I'm going to boil it with some ingredients. I'm going to add vegeta, chicken broth mix and uh, pork seasoning. Then I'm going to add some white onions and cover and leave it start boil. I'm not going to add water. <laughs> I'm going to start to prepare the ingredients. I'm going to blend the tomato, garlic, ginger, and green onions. So these ingredients I'm going to add them on top after adding the ingredients I blend it's celery, white onions, yellow pepper and green onions. So once adding all the ingredients, I'm going to add water and oil and some powder seasonings. I'm going to add vegeta, pork seasoning and nutmeg. going to add red pepper and cover and leave it to cook for a couple minutes this recipe it's so delicious and very easy and simple to make not complicated very very easy now the meat is cooked i'm going to place it aside this is how it look like so delicious you guys le good dessert mm -mm -mm. so then i'm going to start to prepare the vegetables
So I'm just going to leave these vegetables in hot water and I add baking soda behind the camera so they can remain with green color and then I'm going to start to prepare the ingredients. So after a couple minutes, I'm going now to rinse the vegetables very well to remove the taste of baking soda. Then I'm going to place it to the oven and add all the ingredients. I'm going to cook it very simple, kind of boil, very, very simple. So I wait for the vegetables to start to boil then I add all the ingredients as you can see I add the ingredients I cut and I'm going to add oil and some powder seasonings. So I just add vegeta, chicken broth and kibbe of vegetables. So now the food is cooked, I'm going to serve in the bowls, then we are going to eat. After that, I'm going to clean the dishes. So this is the end of our recipe, I'm going to do a quick presentation, then I'm going to clean the dishes. Now I'm going to clean the dishes so my sink can stay clean and empty and this is the end of the video. Thank you so much again for watching. Hope you loved the recipe and if it's your first time to be here, don't forget to subscribe. So catch up very very soon in my next video. Bye!